as soon as we got here. Right on cue. Oh, a striper. Wow. I saw your rod from way over there. Yeah. Jiggling. I was like, that's a big perch. Pretty cool. Hello, guys. I don't know, 15 inches. Ooh, I got it high. All right, bro. You double item. <laughs> One on each side. Ouch. Damn, he's got trebles and old eyes. That's crazy, but look at how healthy that one is, guys. Ocean striper. Nice stripes, but look Dangerous at those fins. One. Perfect fins. That's no hatchery fish right there. Good start today, Adam. Yay! First perch in a long time, guys. And she's a beautiful one. Look at that purple on the top. All right, guys, check that out. First surf perch in a long, long time. Beautiful fish. Really beautiful fish. If you guys are wondering what kind of hook this is, this is a bait holder hook, a little bit offset, size number two. Okay, I'm having fun now. I'm having fun. Guy. No water release, Adam. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's better. Oh, yeah. Good one, Nick. Team OCL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's. <laughs> oh, All right, guys. Good one. OCL. That's right, Team OCL. Yeah, this one fought good. Thanks. Okay. This is called a, a perch. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. That's so cool. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful. Look out behind you. Yeah, yeah. Right All right, rest again. Next yeah! Week, with the catch. Zero here. And look at that right. That was saying right under 12. Badge, get the badge. Don't forget the keyword. 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 Kindness. Kill him with the kindness. Alright, Nick. Release. Really? It felt big. It felt big. And the fight was amazing. Alright guys, welcome back to another episode. We're with Outdoor Chef Life. And we're doing a little bit of perch fishing today for the More Than Fishing Tournament. 
I'm using a fish finder rig here with a three ounce pyramid weight. I have 15 pound fluorocarbon to a size six bait holder hook. And as for bait, I have a soft shell sand crab. Let's see how long it takes to get bit. That was a good bite. Damn, missed it. That was a really good one, wow. I think if I was using a bigger hook on that one, I would have had him. <laughs> Try it, qualifier. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm here with Outdoor Chef Life. What's up guys? We're doing a little foraging on the beach little fishing. I'm using this big old sand crab to catch my next fish. Going for the big one. Taku maybe has 10 fish already today, so he's going for a big one now. So we've been searching along the beach for some nice sand crabs to use as live bait for our surf perch. And today specifically we're targeting barred surf perch. So we're going to follow Taku. He's using the Carolina rig some fresh sand crabs, cast it out, let's see how long this takes, 10, 9, 8, so Taku can you talk us a little bit about uh, what you're thinking about when you're fishing the Carolina rig? It's just a smaller weight that I have on here, the current isn't very fast, it's staying pretty still, so I don't need that much weight so I can still the fish fully. Just a lighter setup. Easier to cast all day. Yeah, easier, but pretty much the same thing. You're moving it a little bit more than the fish finder rig. Is yeah, that right? Yeah, I can kind of like retrieve it slowly and kind of search from way out there to close in. Okay. So that's about the speed that you're reeling and then yeah, he no, pauses. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll leave it there for a couple, you know, like a couple waves. Kind of move with the waves, move with the current, and they're going kind of back and forth like this with the waves. Whoosh, whoosh, they're not still. So I just kind of move it around. So actually that bite that we saw on camera, guys, the fish actually took the bait. So we were fishing with no bait. These surf perch are really good at stealing the bait. They got really small mouth. So we're using small hooks, size six. Can you show us the hook you're using? And what are you doing over there, Taku? <laughs> I'm making a, a soft shell. They soft like, shell sushi? Yeah, they like it like this. I've been catching all mine like this today. Wow. <laughs> Peel the shell back. It's a little savage, but... Uh, I've never seen anybody do that, actually. It's been working today. So basically, he removes the top hard shell. So when they put it in their, in their mouth, they only feel soft stuff and they, they don't want to spit it out right away. I'm simulating a molting sand crab. And I just have to make sure it's on there pretty good. Because these come off pretty easily once you take the shell off like that. But this is on there pretty good. Wow, I think look I'll at get that one. guys. I think I'll get one here. So he casted it out maybe 15 or 20 yards. Then he lets it drop all the way to the bottom, does a couple cranks just to tighten up the line yep. and kind of straighten out his weight. So we'll just wait. And then he's waiting, he's watching his tip. Honestly, today the bite's been hotter during this outgoing tide. The past hour's been pretty good with the bite. Oh yeah, this one's got eggs in it too. 
Looks like looks so big it's a Dungeness crab. <laughs> oh more eggs. Thank you. Oh more eggs. Getting lucky right now. Oh, oh this one's got eggs too, a little bit. Wow, you see with Taku, he doesn't care if it's hard or soft shell. He just wants the one with bright eggs like that. Because he ends up taking off the shell anyways. <laughs> Soft shell are better. Well, they're easier, I guess. Preferably, you guys want soft shell sand crabs when fishing for perch. If it's soft, they're more likely to keep it in their mouths or chew on it, swallow it. It gives you a little bit more time to set the hook. But sometimes when you come to the beach, there just isn't any soft shells that day. So doing what Taku does is a good option. Super pretty, guys. The gold and the purples, yeah. greens, silver. Yeah. Just looks tasty. Look at that hook set, guys. Can you get any better than that? Size six hook, guys. No. Ow. Awesome release. Jeez, look at that fight. Nice. Nice one. That one's better. Dude, the one you caught earlier was so big. I know. Yeah, the other one was so big. So big. It's a, That's a nice one. Yeah. Looks about 11 or 12, maybe? Yeah, let's go measure them. How to do this quick, guys. Oh, it's definitely fight, fight the puck. 11 and a half, guys. Outdoor chef life on the board. There you go, Team Outdoor Chef Life. There you go. At the zero. All right, guys, that ends it for today. 10 surf perch, 10 barred surf perch, and a huge shout out to Outdoor Chef Life and Die Hard Fishing for teaching me how to surf fish. This has opened up a whole new game for me. So thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.